Well, hello, my family fans. I love you all. Oh, yes, Nicholas of Birmingham, I did get your letter. But how the hell do you expect me to send you a signed photograph? I can't hold a bloody pen with these claws. Now, be honest, what do you think of my new hairstyle? I've hired an image consultant with a fee I received from a cameo appearance in a History Channel documentary. I'm getting a lot of offers. These appearances on my video diary has shown how versatile I am as an actress. I can demonstrate a wide range of emotions, you know. Joy. Anger. Jealousy. Depression. Contemplation. Boredom. And at the moment, I'm in negotiation to do a guest spot in Primeval. But they're having trouble meeting my demands because there's no way I'm sharing a trailer with that upstart Rex. And I'd better get script control. I'm not going to be get myself killed off, not if there's a chance of becoming a recurring character. Besides, I hate playing corpses. I get cramp. But apparently, the real money is in voiceovers for adverts. Unfortunately, I've been told I don't stand a chance of getting one of those with my accent. Gwen has been up to her old tricks again. Honestly, the rate she's going, she'll have to have her fanny retard traded. Well, this time she had an affair with a metamorph. And they are a right tricky buggers to break up with because they can sneak back as anything, apparently. Anyway, when he, if it was he left, he gave her the gift that keeps coming back. Crabs. And not the tall pinching ones at the seaside type, if you catch my drift. Oh, and eventually had to hunt the little bleeders down with an electrified baseball bat. He got it from Ianto. Honestly, the amount of junk this place has collected over the years, we could do with a damn good clear out. Not that Owen is in particularly good company at the moment. In fact, he's become very moody and aggressive. And considering that this is Owen we're talking about, that's saying something. Not that there's anything wrong with him. Owen's always got like that. at the start of the football season. Well, it serves him right for supporting West Ham. A Jack caused a bit of a stir, too. He has this daft habit of standing on top of tall towels looking all broody. Well, that's what he thinks he looks like. Actually, he looks like he's been suffering from chronic constipation. And anyway, this time, someone spotted him and thought he was going to commit suicide. He had an awful job explaining his behaviour to the police. All the emergency services being called round, gathering at the bottom with a catch net. Very embarrassing. Gwen eventually convinced them that he was part of a staff training exercise. Something about feeling the fear and doing it anyway. And I only think they got convinced them to go away because it saved on the paperwork. And one of these days, I'm going to swoop up behind him and knock him off. Well, it's not as if he can't get back up again. Ooh, what's that terrible smell? Oh my God. Oh, he's left his trainers out to dry in here. Ah!